Hi guys, this is my Asda shop for this week. I'll start off with the meats here because I got quite a few of them. I got some um, minced beef and two packs of lean turkey. These were actually a substitution um, and I'm going to be putting them into the freezer because they've got a very short date. I also ordered a, I think it was um, a different meat. It should have cost £5 but they substituted it so they actually give you the more expensive one for the same price as the one you originally had in your basket. So that's going to be for some roast beef it looks all right actually i got a dehydrator for christmas and i really want to make some beef jerky with it so i got two steaks and it was two for seven pounds and i will be making some jerky with that and another short date on this one which was my chicken wings and um, but we'll probably eat those quite quickly i think i've mentioned previously that asdas don't have the largest range of organic stuff but the bits that they do have are quite cheap so i got these two packets of organic flour and then i got a whole load of veg so i have butternut squash um two loose courgettes some baking potatoes garlic um, a bag of shallots and then i also got a bag of sweet potatoes I got two heads of broccoli. What else have I got in here? Let's have a dig. I'll just show you the pastas and then I'll, uh, there's more veg to come, so I'll come back to those. These um, whole wheat, this um, good and balanced range, it seems quite nice and actually it was quite cheap. It was a bag, well, two different bags of pasta. So I got the um, penne pasta and then the whole wheat spaghetti and they were a pound, a pound for two, which is quite good. It's a little bit dusty. I think that has come from the flour, I don't think it's inside the packet of spaghetti. I got whole almonds, I really like these um, roasted. I'm gonna do a couple of meals with lots of roast veg in them. I also thought they would be good for snacking and I wanted to mix them with some Brazil nuts but they were out of stock and they didn't have a substitution for those, we just didn't, didn't get anything. And back on the veg, I got white mushrooms, two red peppers, a cauliflower, this looks quite nice actually. Sometimes it's a bit hit and miss with the cauliflowers. I'm really enjoying roast cauliflower at the moment. And I also got a bag of baby spinach that was 75p. Spinach is one I like to get organic if I can, but they didn't have one, so I went for this one. And then I got some wholemeal tortillas. I'm going to do a chili one of the evenings and I thought these would just be easy. They freeze quite nicely as well. And just onto the last couple of bits I got. So this is Asda's, um, organic tomato range well maybe it's not theirs actually it looks like it's this tarantella tarantella um ones we've got two tins of chopped tomatoes the tins are pretty bashed up which isn't really ideal uh i suppose it doesn't matter but it just makes them a bit of a pain for stacking and then i got these two jars of the passata two cans of red kidney beans i think these were 68p each which is really good um and they will go in the chili and then I also got an organic mixed beans so this is my meal plan for the coming week I'm hoping this stuff will do me about a week and a half I would like to try and do an Asda shop every two weeks and then just get my fruit box in the middle but I haven't managed to, to get into that routine yet but hopefully this year and this whole shop it came to 45 pounds and 38 pence which I actually think there's there's quite a lot here for that amount i'm quite impressed with that because sometimes it doesn't look like very much but now i've started to go through i think there is quite a bit here so that's everything for this week and i should have another haul for you next monday guys thanks for watching Bye bye